welcome back. It's time to check in with entertainment. Roxana Paul has the latest. Thank you. Univision host Rodney Figueroa has been fired after saying that Michelle Obama, quote, looks like she's from the cast of Planet of the Apes. The, the host made the remarks during his live segment on the entertainment news show El Gordo y la Flaca. Univision called Figueroa's comments, quote, completely reprehensible and in no way reflect the values or opinions of Univision, end quote. Figueroa apologized to the First Lady in an open letter that has gone viral, saying in part, quote, there is no excuse for a professional like me to do these types of comments that can be interpreted as offensive and racist in such a volatile times in our country, end quote. Figueroa won a Daytime Emmy Award in 2014. He has been with the network for 17 years. Johnny Depp flew back to Los Angeles after injuring his right hand while on set for the fifth franchise, Pirates of the Caribbean. Rumors say Depp broke his right wrist while going go-karting on a private track at five-time MotoGP world champion Mick Duhan's residence. The 51-year-old actor was smiling and waving at fans while making his way into the plane. The production of the film it is expected to be minimally affected by the star's absence. The release date of the movie remains unchanged. Padres tickets are selling fast and an announcement by a legendary rock band may make Petco Park the place to be this summer. The Rolling Stones will be coming to Petco in late May. An official date has not been set, but it will be likely 24th of May. The band was the first music act to perform at Petco Park back in 2005 when they performed a sold out show for their A Big Bigger Bang tour. The city is getting ready for one of the largest single day events in San Diego. The St. Patrick's Day festivities take place tomorrow morning in downtown. With more than 120 parade entries and thousands in attendance, the festival is an event for the entire family. Food and drinks as well as craft booths will be open during the event. For the little ones, the festival offers an authentic Celtic village and kids don wolf games, rides, face painting, llamas and much more. Authentic fighting demonstrations as well as Irish dance, song, crafts and storytelling will entertain the public. The festival is free to the public. Lots of thing, uh, things happening in San Diego this weekend. The Latin Fe Film Festival celebrates its 22nd anniversary. Also, the Electronic Music Festival Cross kicks off tomorrow in downtown. I'll send it back to you, ladies. Thank you so much, Roxana.